Um, hello, I'm Andrew Davis. I'm 22 years old. Um, I was born in Corby in the UK. I now live in Leicester. Um, and I'm here in Berlin uh, for a week, um, looking all around the city here for New Year's, just experiencing what it's like as a city. I think I've kind of got that now. Um, we've just been looking around the Neue Gal Gallery, or New Gallery. Um, seen some really interesting paintings from about the 70s through to about 2000. Um, really interesting because you've got reactions that are kind of similar to sort of like German expressionism in a way. It was like a revolt against something in there quite a lot of the time for me. Um, you know, liberation, like there was war is quite a thing that as, hu as humans we can never really seem to escape from and it's something that, you know, pop all throughout there, like glamorising like the camouflage or you know just sort of showing the vulgarity of soldiers just sort of on the front cover of every newspaper, kind of making them look a bit glamorous and sexy and, just, and artists just saying well no I don't agree with that and sort of putting it in the museum and, and pointing it out makes it sort of, it makes you wonder and question about it so um, yeah, it just kind of, it felt liberating in a way. Some of it was confusing. I think you always find that. Um, but, it, you know, it's, express, it's expressing yourself, expressionism. You've just got to, if you don't get it, you don't get it. But I think having the right to express yourself is important anyway. Confusion. Yeah, confusion. Um, the one at the beginning stood out was uh, the one with all the sort of geometry, so like the shapes, lines, and circles and stuff. Um, it just seemed to like tell me something hidden about the universe, you know? Like I think he was trying to say like. You know how they say like the universe is all made up of like mathematical codes and stuff like that. It was almost like he was trying to give us the essence of like reality in a way, which which kind of stood out for me. Yeah. Um, I didn't really like the black and white one, the print um, with the sort of people who looked kind of like they were in poverty on the street, sort of crawling around. Um, it just. It, um, it, it was too dense for me. And maybe that's what he was trying to do. Um, but yeah, it was just too dense and I couldn't really suss it out. It didn't tell me a lot. Um, yeah, I think, I think now like, we live in a sort of global culture. I think some of those pictures, like the one with the kind of fat cats at the front and the industry in the background, like they're all something like that. It's something with the economy that we all try and struggle with. You know, we're all trying to make a better, sort of, a better reality for everybody, really. Um, and I think, as well with things like the um, recession and stuff like that, I think that kind of relates to people in the UK at the moment. You know, people are finding it hard, but maybe not as hard as obviously the people were finding it at the time during like the, the war and stuff. But and I think hope as well. Like we're all sort of looking for hope. <laughs>